one of the very first videos I did on this channel when I first got started was a smoked stuffed peppers recipe, man. My wife and I loved it. They were delicious. But there was one thing missing. And that one thing was the most important thing, smoke. I'm about to tell you what I did wrong and what I did to fix it right now. First of all, let's get the grill set up. While the grill is coming up to temp, let's get started on our stuffing recipe. The recipe for the stuffing is not going to change from last time, so let's start off with one pound of ground beef and one pound of hot Italian sausage. Now I want you to pay very close attention to what I do right now because this is where we change the game. See, I realized after some reading and after asking some questions that the reason why I didn't get any smoke in my stuffing is because the stuffing is down inside the pepper, so the smoke can't get to it. So this time around, to change that, I decided to smoke my meat before we put it inside of the peppers. So I took my ground beef and sausage mixture, I put it in my cast iron skillet, and I flattened it out all the way to the edges. Now I'm doing that to create more surface area for the smoke to adhere to. Next, I'm just gonna hit it with some light seasoning, some salt and pepper, and we're ready to go out to the smoker. Heading out to the grill to check on the ground beef. It's about, it's been about a half an hour. It takes about an hour for ground beef to smoke. I don't want it to be completely smoked though, because I want to add the other ingredients and, and be able to finish it off. So I'm gonna see what it looks like right now and I might pull it, add the other ingredients and then put it back out here. So my meat is already browning at this point. So I wanted to go ahead and start breaking it up, getting it down to a fine consistency with no big pieces in there. Then once I had it all broken up to the right consistency, I went ahead and started adding the rest of the ingredients. We got one jar of pasta sauce, one can of diced fire roasted tomatoes, and one bag of Uncle Ben's ready rice. So from here, we're just gonna mix everything up well and just let everything marinate together, let all those flavors marinate and get that smoke until the meat is completely done and the rice is tender. My stuffing is ready now, so let's put it in the peppers. I added a slice of cheese to the bottom of each one. This is pepper jack cheese I'm using. Then I filled it about halfway with my stuffing and then added another piece of cheese in the middle. <laughs> Finally, I filled them all to the top and then added a whole slice of pepper jack cheese over the top so that I get that melt over. Then I let them go a few more minutes to warm up and soften my peppers. Get that cheese all melted. And when these babies are done, it's time for the taste test. Man, oh man, what a difference. You're not going to believe the difference it makes to do your stuffing on the outside, on the grill, before you put them inside of your peppers, man. You have got to try this. Smoke Peppers 2.0, baby. Let's go.